sometimes. Before I go, thanks shit like hey, that. Hey, it's my guardian angel. Uh, I think you owe me something. Well, I guess I do owe you. Here, take this. It's my lucky necklace. Hopefully it'll work for you as good as it did for me. 15 South Side Salisbury Little Star Bottle Caps. Wow. Okay. See you. Right. Fantastic. <laughs> Amazing. Patient files. Nothing. Experiments. Like a nothing. Awesome. What a useless computer. <laughs> uh. Trading center. William June, okay. What's up, William? Don't get new people much. I'm guessing you're looking to trade. Where do you get your equipment? Jacob's guys bring it in on hunts or raids. Not sure from where, but I don't ask questions. Uh, what can you tell me about the town? Oh, geez, dude. Uh, well, it's a town, but it's in a cave. Sure is, William. I don't really know what else I can tell you, man. Okay, thank you. Of course. Uh, what's your opinion on mutants? Oh, man, I hate those freaks. I mean, Dietz. He knows how evil they really are. Him and Jacob might as well cleanse these lands. I mean, I hope. Dietz says there'll be trouble in the following years, but he trusts that the strong will survive. Me and my sister are with that. Uh... You know what that vigil is in front is for? Oh, that's... It's like a grave for my stepmom. Something Georgia carved. Don't ask me how. Hmm. All right. What do you got to sell? You got it. A uh, laser rifle. Okay. Leather armor. And drugs. I'll take the mentats. And the fixer. Ramshackle suppressor. Uh, okay. Need any ammo? I think I got a lot. I'll be going. Till next time. Okay. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just gonna fucking, uh, break into here. Lord. Oh, good lord. Boom. Huh. Now that I'm in here, it doesn't matter. I can take it all. This was just a test. If I could open it, open that gate without him knowing, I could have everything. Look at that. Even the safe. Oh, just an actual sniper rifle. Not ramshackle, not... Fucking covert. This is a normal sniper rifle. Uh... Alright, let's fix that. Still got one. One pound over. Drink a root beer.
Travis again. That's it. Lodge, okay. And that's it. Let's see what's in the lodge. Done. Hey, haven't seen someone new come here since Jacob. That's great. Is there anything I can get you? Who are you? Name's Dunn. Nice to meet you. Pleasure. <laughs> Wait, who are you? Uh, let's see what you have. Uh, what can you tell me about this place? It's a great place to live. Dietz is a good man. And with Jacob by his side, I imagine we'll have a prosperous future. Everyone out there, they're willingly getting fucked by two of the biggest monsters this fucked up world made. At the very least, those Legion bastards don't lie about what they do, unlike the NCR, worst of them all. If you had asked me years ago if a uh, utopia could exist, well, I still don't think we're there yet. Not since we lost a part of the town. Uh, cave collapse, you mean? There's more to this place? Oh, yeah. There was a pretty bad cave collapse. Knocked out one of the lifts we used to get to the higher parts of the cave. Haven't been able to get to them. Probably fell into the dark depths. Hmm. What's the deal with that vigil outside the bar? That's a memorial. Dietz had it put together for his wife. Georgia carved the top of the pillar into that statue, you see. I never met his wife. But from what I heard, she's the main reason we all came together here. It's a spiritual symbol in a way. Uh, so what's the deal with the anti-mutant policy? They defy God's plan with their existence. It's not what was supposed to be, so it is our job to put them where they belong. I didn't always think like this, but Dietz, he showed me the way. You should talk to Dietz. And you'll understand. Uh, you don't get many visitors, do you? Well, I used to live elsewhere a long time ago. And Jacob has only been living here for a few years. But other than that, we don't get many visitors. Who's in charge here? That would be Dietz. He's what you would call our spiritual leader. Mm -hmm. He's what you would call a semblance of a miracle. I know makes him sound holier than thou, but he cares for us. His wisdom of this world and the next brought many together. Jacob, on the other hand, is, well, he's like Dietz, but he doesn't handle the burden as well as Dietz has. Regardless, he knows what he's doing. Hmm. Okay. Oh, God damn it. Oh, you piece of shit. <laughs> piece of shit doesn't have a, a goodbye no ah uh, well don't talk to him I guess how's it treating you? fucking done piece of shit not letting me leave our conversation Jacob. I guess this is where he lives. Heavy precision rifle. All right. You must be the newest addition to our group. Hmm. You don't look like much, but I suppose you'll have time to prove your worth. I am Jacob, second in command of the Portland Militiamen. I should warn you that if you happen to cross me, it won't end well. Yeah, right. And should you prove to be a detriment to our society, a parasite, you will be made just as irrelevant. 
Uh, I heard whispers that you were once in the NCR. That's no secret. Yes, I was with them. Once. I learned very soon how they lacked certain values. They're one of the last things left that resembles the old world, and it would be best if they were exterminated. Even now, they begin to wither and die as the people lose faith in them. Uh, what's your opinion on the Legion? The Legion has its strengths, but what they lack in is imagination. Or rather, adaptation. But like roaches, they cling to life. At most, they're children, trying to recreate the shadows their father cast. It will either change or die. More than I can say about the NCR. What do you think about the NCR? Parasites. Leeching the blood and life from young men and women looking to prove their worth. Even the ones that are here are no different. Even though they're rogue, I see very little difference in methodology. Like all parasites, they need to be exterminated. That or their food source. Uh, do you have any work? I don't have any work for you. But if you're looking to prove yourself, bring me trophies of any NCR dog you put down. Their dog tag should work. Goodbye. Until next time. I don't want your rifle. How's it treating you? Mag 11. Why are you here? Gonna come out. Thanks. <laughs> Heavy precision uses fifty MG. I'm eighteen over now. Oh boy. You Let me adjust space. the gear in my bag. Make sure I have some stim packs. I'll use them in battle so you can focus on the fight. Uh huh. Uh, don't shoot while crouching. Twenty-five. Uh. Okay. That heavy time. precision rifle needs to be fixed. Full cues, triangle. We should, we should still see what it looks like, right? Damn. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> that, uh... That will murder. I'm sure of it. Okay. 
guess we can go up this tower. Sure, there'll be something up here, and it doesn't. Okay. Tom's house. The house up here. Alright, Tom. Got any uh, things I can steal from you? Port carbine. I have an assault carbine. What the fuck is a support carbine? <laughs> uh, it uses 5mm, okay. Damage 12, but it's conditions garbage. 101 on the DPS. 19. This DPS is way high. So maybe this will be stronger when it's... Well, uh, when it's conditions good, because it's at 12. Down, down pretty low. Hmm. We can use the assault. Hold on. Before we do that. Damn it. Quick save, and now we can check. It is 17. That's a no, because... Because, uh, uh... Salt was 19. And it's quicker. Get the fuck out of here. That's empty. Uh, I don't consider myself a righteous man, I consider myself a sane man, and the way things are going around here, it's the work of an insane man who claims that he's righteous. I was lucky for, the, uh, for these people to have offered me food and shelter when I was inches away from death. I merely considered their ideals a small price to pay for life. I always... I was always kind of kind when approaching the concept of God or a higher power, which they seemed to revel in some way. Eats was still the one who was more uh, more likely to listen to the to reason on this account. Seemingly, that new right hand of his is gangrenous in nature as as of late. Another person from outside, like me, although he was from that group of soldiers calling themselves the NCR. Considering Dietz's, Dietz's fear of the outside world and any real governing force, I was surprised he even let uh, let the man in. Jacob is his name, a cold-hearted psychopath, if there ever was one. He's taking up some real land up over in one of the back caves, turning it, uh, turning it into his little prison. I was never partial to ghouls, but the but he does that to all the ones he finds. Uh, committing acts like that is just inhumane, even, even if it's the on those zombies. Like I said, I never fully agreed with Dietz's values and ideals, and he accepted that. But now Dietz is getting sick, old age, and the way things are right now, I'm worried that Jacob might take over. Even now, he's inches away from turning this place into a totalitarian regime. Uh... If that happens, I might have to take a chance with the cold again, if I can bear it. I had that dream again about the harsh cold, the icy wilderness pulling me back into the devil its devilish grasp. It's been a year since I've even dared to get close to the cave's exit. Georgia says I just need to take things slow, but then I have people like Gunny calling me a pussy while I try to fix the uh, fix his rifle in that. Uh, damp hovel he calls a cantina. I just need to shake that off. He's old and grouchy. Forget the fact that most of the buildings in this town are still standing because of me and Dixie, of course. Uh, I never would have... I never would have... Uh, I never would have what I have out here, out there. It's nice to live in a place where I'm needed. Not if Jacob gets his way. I really just hope I'm being, um, being paranoid about that. 
I just try my best to keep away from him. Anyways, I saw something a bit strange this morning. After my dream, I had to I had to catch a quick breather outside. That's when I saw him heading into the Lost Cavern this morning. They call him El Rey. I was surprised. Supposedly, that place was off limits ever since those kids died. Wonder what he was doing in there. I wouldn't dare follow him. I've heard that some of those creatures that lurk uh, on the outside nested in there. Maybe that's where uh, what he's doing. I heard he was some sort of butcher. Never really talked to him because he kind of creeps me out with those bug eyes. Uh, it's been a few days and Dietz has been getting worse. On the on a good day, he can barely leave his house. On a bad day, he can barely get up to take a shit. At least that's what Georgia claims. Uh, Jacob has been giving more authoritative control lately. And already he's stirring up trouble. This little girl lost some food down one of the gorges today, and Jacob grabbed her by the arm, held her over the abyss, acted like he was going to throw her over, he said that, uh, he said that was a warning. What does Deed see in this man? I want to leave, but I still can't, uh, just can't bear to do it. I still have the scars and the, and those images in my head, burning into my skull like an ancient tapestry. Until I can bear it, I have to convince Deeds that Jacob is mentally unfit to lead, but I wouldn't know where to even start. Well, we can find Tom. Maybe we can do that. Also, Georgia, I said to Georgia that I'd look at her dad, see if I can do something. Guess we can go do that. You know what? Let's go see what we can do. The fuck have you people been? Deeds. I'm here to heal you. 